Friday night, the Wizards road trip continued in Utah against the Jazz, who were coming off their back-to-back-to-back. A whole lot of love prior to the game. Dick Bavetta, John Wall, Al Jefferson, Devin Harris all getting into the act. And then the Jazz went to work. Al Jefferson gets above the rim. Now Washington gets fancy. John Wall feeding JaVale McGee. It was a one-point Utah lead at this point of the contest. Rajah Bell gets the loose ball and buries the three. Bell's 17th game in a row, making at least one three-pointer. He's right behind Jody Meeks. He's got 25 straight. Bell had just 10 points. This is John Wall with a nice move inside. Two of his 24. Washington within nine. Now Jordan Crawford, the fadeaway, part of a 21-point performance. Devin Harris feeding the big fella. Jefferson makes it 44-35. More from AJ, 48-37 Utah. And then Jefferson gets creative as time winds down in the second quarter, takes his own miss and turns it into a deuce. Jefferson 12 of 15 from the floor, 26 points and a half. Most points and a half by any Jazz player this season. They led by 12 as we move to the third quarter. Devin Harris, no. Paul Millsap gets the putback. He scored just 14 total points over the last two games. Back to the big fella. Jefferson finished with 34 points and 12 rebounds. His 12th dub-dub of the season. Now Paul Millsap gets the offensive board. And then Millsap goes right back into traffic, the bucket, and one more. Mentioned he had 14 over the last two total. Finished this game with 14, along with 12 rebounds. Alec Burke, the driving layup. He had 13. The Jazz win it 114 to 100. Season high in points for Utah as they snap their two-game losing streak.